happy Sunday. Welcome back to my channel. The sun is playing me. So right now I'm actually on my way to Starbucks. I'm just gonna go get a drink for me and aunt, my boyfriend. Um, he's actually at work right now. I have to go drop him off money because he left his wallet at home and he needs gas. Um, so he wouldn't make it home if um, he didn't get gas in his car. So I have to go give him money to get gas. Um, he goes to work pretty early, so I guess he was like running late and couldn't look for his wallet. I'm not really sure. Haven't really spoken to him that much this morning, but I'm gonna go to Bucks. I kinda want Duncan instead. Yeah, Duncan it is, cause that Starbucks line is... Also, I'm actually in the Dunkin Donuts drive through line right now because she needs some coffee. I just filmed another video, so um, it's Sunday. Me and Aunt usually just chill today and we watch the games. He's obsessed with football, so that's why I filmed because I wanted to edit while he watched because if you have a boyfriend or husband that loves football, you know that like they will not pay attention to you like for anything, so. Hi, can I have a medium mocha iced coffee with almond milk? Okay, anything else? And can I also have a medium iced tea with extra liquid sugar? Okay. And that's it. Good job, Ron. Five or seven. Thank you. So he's gonna watch the games and then um, I'm gonna edit at the same time um, because he's not gonna pay attention to me anyway, so. Get on the money. Do it up for some Valentino. I'm with the killers gonna be. And I'm actually gonna pay for the lady behind me today, just because I feel like it. Hi, how are you? I'm gonna pay for the person behind me too. Oh, it's 539, okay? Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Have a good one. Nobody knows how to drive today, like, no joke. So I got a medium mocha iced coffee, which is my favorite with almond milk. And I paid for the lady behind me. You know when you could just kind of like tell when someone's like frazzled? So, I don't know, I just... I don't know. I've been doing that a lot recently, paying for the person behind me, and it just like, it makes me feel so good because if someone were to do that to me, like if I got up to the drive through window and then like, you know, if they were like, oh, the person in front of you took care of it, like I would be so happy. Like that would make my day. That's the reason why I do it is because like, I know that I would, you know, I would like that to happen to me. So that's why I'm gonna do it to other people. Mm. If you're watching this, whoever you are, if you get coffee a lot, I challenge you to go and pay for the person behind you. But if maybe you could ask to be like, how much is the person's order behind me? Um, and then if it's like a price that you don't mind paying, like obviously if it's over like, you know, 15 bucks or 20 bucks, not everybody can do that, you know? So. You could always ask too, I'm sure that they wouldn't have a problem with it. So, I know this is a pretty boring vlog, but you know, I'm pretty boring. So recently, I've been like super busy with clients. I don't know, like out of nowhere, so many people just started booking me. If you don't know, I'm a freelance makeup artist. Um, I do it full time, um, all on my own, um, and Lately, like, it was just so weird. I felt like so many people out of nowhere just, like, started booking me. So, it was just so, so strange. I mean, I'm very grateful for that, but, like, I don't know if I posted, like, a certain picture that a lot of people liked or, um, hello, like, the sun. So, I just found my prom appointments from, like, a few years ago, and, guys, I charged $10 for a trial. $10 for a trial and the day of I think I charged 40 or 45 and I was just like shook so it was just so so crazy for me to look back at that like I feel like right now I kind of have like a creative block right now like I'm 
just confused on like what I should be doing. Like if I should be working with more photographers or if I should just be using more models and doing bridal looks. I'm kind of like all over the place because I'm not sure what I should be doing. I get a little discouraged because, you know, I just, I know what I want to do. I want to be a celebrity makeup artist. I would still love to do like TV and film. So anything around that type of stuff I would love to do so I'm just trying to figure out what I should do um, as far as like my like posting on social media um, because I do love bridal also you know I get a little discouraged sometimes just because um, you know after I found that that note like I realized like I've been doing makeup for so long and like Sometimes I just think like, what am I doing wrong? Like, I feel like I'm not attracting the people that I need to attract to, you know, you know, I don't know. Sometimes I just, I get in these like moods where I'm just like, what can I do to like have someone notice me? So, sorry guys, my camera overheated, but um, basically, what I wanted to get at is if you are at like a creative block right now like if you're just like not if you're like not feeling like inspired like just know that it's okay like it happens to a lot of people that are very creative um, sometimes you just need something new to inspire you so go to new places talk to new people you know just try to expand your horizon and you will be inspired again if you surround yourself with like different people and more creative people and just people that you know are different than what, who you normally hang out with I'm not saying anything bad towards the people that you do hang out with but sometimes you just need like a change I want to go to the Mitchell and Stacy makeup class in January and that is what I feel like I'm like looking forward to it right now and it's like already inspiring me to like do more looks like them so you know if I get the chance to meet them I could show them or even do it on myself like just to practice and like you know like let them know that like they're a huge inspiration to me like that's what I want to do sometimes you just need like new inspiration you just need new things in your life just to you know pick yourself back up so if you are one of those people that are kind of like in a funk right now it's going to get better like let me tell you because it happens to me all the time I just you know I do different things I watch you know different youtubers and everything like that I just watch different people I just wanted everybody to know that like even if you are in a funk like that doesn't mean that like your career is not for you and you know whatever unless you're actually unhappy that's completely different like for me I'm just a little unmotivated right now I'm not unhappy at all I'm just a little like I don't know I just lost my creative spark and like that's what I need to get back so yeah if you are going through something like that like just stick it out meet new people do like do new things and just you know try new things out and just explore and you know your motivation and your inspiration will just like come back in no time I promise Alright guys, so that's going to be it for this video. I know it was kind of like all over the place and it was kind of short, but um, I have a lot to do today. I have a lot of editing to do, so thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!